Hi, I'm Will White with ITS, and I'm here to tell you about CNU's new Shortel phone system. Let's talk about some details of how the phone system is going to be implemented. You'll get your new phone uh, the weekend of July 21st through 23rd. There's nothing you have to do in order to request it, and you don't have to be there. There will be no changes to your phone number or extension, so people will be able to call you, and you'll be able to call people just like you did before. Your phone will work immediately. There's nothing you have to do to set it up. But you will have to set up your voicemail again as it's a brand new voicemail system. Finally, this new phone system has a software client which is available on request. These first few videos won't cover the software client, but you'll see some later on that will. All right, let's take a look at your new phone. Let's take a look at the basics of your new Shortel phone. The first thing you'll notice is this LED up here at the top. That's blinking to let you know you have a message. The next thing you'll notice is this voicemail icon that shows us that we have voicemails. We'll discuss your voicemail in a later video. Along each side are the call appearance buttons. You can also use these as speed dial, which we'll show you in a later video. But the buttons beside the different little phone icons light up in different colors based on what's going on with your phone. If they're flashing green, that means someone's trying to call you. If they're solid green, it means you're on the line. If they're flashing orange, it means the person is on hold. And if they are a solid orange, it means you have set your phone to a do not disturb state. We'll talk about states in a later video as well. Below that, you see the soft keys. These change based on what you're doing with your phone. And you can see on the screen what they do at any given moment. This is the volume rocker. It controls the volume of every aspect of the phone. If you don't touch anything while using the volume rocker, it controls the ringer volume. If you have the handset picked up, it will control the volume of your calls. If you have the headset or speakerphone buttons held down while you're using the volume rocker, it will control the volume of the headset or speaker. Below that, you see the headset and speakerphone buttons. These buttons allow you to either use the built-in speakerphone in your phone, or if you have a headset, we'll turn that on. Between them is the call mute button. This mutes the microphone while you're on a call. Very useful for while you're on, say, a conference call. Everybody's familiar with the dial pad. This operates just like every other phone. To the right of the dial pad, you have the arrow keys, which will help you navigate menus. And in the center of the arrow keys, this button actually will activate whatever is underlined up here on the screen. So if we were to press it now, it would activate the options menu. Then below that, you have the hard keys. We'll cover many of the functions of these in this and other videos. Nothing's changed about the way you make or answer a call. All you need to do to make a call is pick up the handset and dial. After a short while, you'll be connected with another phone. Likewise, answering hasn't changed. If I call this phone, you will shortly see caller ID and see the line light up and flash. Then you can either pick up the handset, or if you want to use the speaker phone, you can just push the button that's flashing. One thing that is easier is that you're actually able to directory dial. All you have to do is press the directory button, and you can search for anybody who is on the phone system. So if I want to search for myself, I start pressing the number key that corresponds to the letters that I want to dial, and then all I have to do is hit dial, and I'll be connected directly. If I want more information, I can hit the open button and find out my email address and whether I'm on the phone or not. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, if you need additional support for your phone, 
call our CNU Help Desk at 757-594-7079 or put in a ticket at help.cnu.edu. Thank you.